guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Alice. I go by Hello Alice here on YouTube and I make art videos. And today I am so excited about the video that I have for you. This is actually not the video I planned on doing for this week, but I saw this idea online uh, Wednesday night and was like, well, that's what I'm gonna be doing for the video. <laughs> so this was very last minute, but I hope that you guys like it. So I found out online about this thing called the Kindness Rocks Project. And it actually kind of goes, um, like loads of different states and cities have it. So I'm based in Colorado Springs. There's actually one in Colorado Springs called 719 Rocks. But basically you take rocks and you paint them and then you leave them for people to find. Um, obviously you have to be very respectful, like, you know, don't leave them like in campgrounds and, you know, places where it's leave no trace and all of that kind of stuff. But um, you kind of leave them around your city and people will take them and it brightens up their day and I just thought it was such a cute idea and so I actually saw this person on reddit who had used Sculpey on their rocks to create like animals and stuff like that and I was like that is a genius idea so I'll actually post a link to a video that she posted down below in the um, description box because she posted a video kind of showing how she does it like a little speed paint but that was super useful. That's kind of what I watched before I attempted to do this. And I just went out to my apartment, like outside my apartment, and picked up a couple rocks. I washed them first, let them dry, and then I used Sculpey to add on these like ears and eyes and little feet and tails and things like that to make them into woodland creatures. So some tips if you guys want to do this, I found that it helps to kind of do it like a thin layer of Sculpey, kind of smush it in before you apply any Sculpey like onto that area it just kind of gives it something to stick to so like before I did the ears I would like apply some Sculpey to the top of the head um, and that kind of helps the Sculpey stick also if you see me kind of dipping in my brush or a, um, a q-tip uh, that's actually vegetable oil vegetable oil helps kind of dissolve Sculpey a little bit and you can smooth it out and make it like nice and smooth but it also kind of helps me stick everything together so once I made my rocks out of Sculpey, I put them in the oven at 275 degrees for 30 minutes. This was probably a little bit too much. Um, they did get a bit burnt. My oven at my apartment is really, I think it runs way too hot because everything I put in there gets burnt. I have to cook things like five minutes less time than I'm supposed to because they just burn otherwise. <laughs> But it worked out okay, and then you want to make sure the rocks cool because as you all know, rocks really do hold on to heat. So I put them outside on my patio for a while to let them cool before I attempted to paint them. <laughs> but once they were cooled, um, I painted them with uh, basically acrylic paints, a combination of craft acrylic and artist acrylic just to get the colors that I needed. And then I varnished them, and that's kind of the process that I used to create these little creatures. So the creatures I made are woodland creatures. Um, I made a little rabbit that I painted this kind of pinky peach and then I painted its details purple. I painted like its muzzle purple and the inside of its ears purple and I painted a little purple heart on its belly. I also painted a little orange fox which I think came out really cute and then my favorite is a deer because it would it really be a Hello Alice video if I didn't paint a deer. I mean, come on, I, I, I love deer. I paint deer all the time, like deer are my favorites. So yeah, uh, I really am like overjoyed with how these came out. And honestly, it was so much fun going out and dropping these off around in my city. I actually saw a little kid pick up the last one that I dropped off and he looks like so excited. And it's just a really, really cool idea, I think. Um, and it's really nice to be able to spread art out into the world. If you guys know me or know my channel, you know that I am huge on kind of spreading art and uh, empowering people to be artists and uh, and create and, and do fun things. And I, I just think this is such a cool way to do that that is accessible to anyone. And you don't have to um, paint your rocks with like Sculpey. You don't have to like add modeling to them if you don't want to. I just already had Sculpey and it was such like a cool idea. And it was surprisingly easy. Honestly, anyone could do this. Um, but if you just want to paint your rocks normally then you can do that as well like there's loads of different things that you can do but I really encourage you to kind of look up um, the kindness rocks project I'll leave a link to that down below look up to see if anyone in your area does it and if nobody does you should just start it yourself like I just think it's so cool so yeah I don't really know what else to say but I thought this would be a really cute video and I thought this was a cool message to share um, I hope that you guys like 
it and I hope you like this project idea. Um, I think this would be really fun to do with kids as well if any of you have kids. So yeah, I'm really happy I did this. It was, it was a really good day. Um, anyway, that is all about my rocks. Uh, I am almost done painting these and then you guys are going to see some footage of me going around and kind of dropping these uh, where I dropped them in my city and yeah, that's pretty much it. So I am going to say goodbye for now and I will see you in the next portion of the video very, very shortly. So I'm on my vlog camera right now if the quality is a little bit different, but it is the next day It is Friday. The video is actually coming out tonight. So you guys will be watching this a little bit later But I'm on my lunch break at work, and I'm going to go and I'm going to put my rocks for people to find um, So I have all my rocks and I wrote on the back take me and then I wrote my YouTube URL. I actually messed up this one a little bit, but whatever. Um, and then I, I can't hold them. I wrote um, hashtag the kindness rocks project, which is um, kind of the project that started this whole thing with the kindness rocks. But we're gonna head on over to that area and hide these. I think I might uh, do a little bit of an Instagram live so some of you may have kind of seen this already. And uh, I put my YouTube channel so that if people do find the rocks and they look on the YouTube channel, they can maybe see this video. So if you're watching this and you found one of these these rocks please comment down below I know there's only three of you so chances are pretty slim but if you did find this rock and you made it to my YouTube channel please comment down below I would love to know who found the rock and which rock you found all right let's go okay guys so we are at the first location that I'm gonna go hide a little rock um, I'm gonna hide my Fox I have a little Instagram live stream going as well so yeah let's go find a good place to put mr. Fox I think like over here maybe? Like what if we put him right here? How does that work? I think that's cute. Okay, Mr. Foxy, I hope you enjoy your new home. All right, we're gone, we're gone. We're out of here. Okay, so we are at the next location. We are gonna drop this guy off at On The Border. This is the On The Border on Academy in Colorado Springs, in case you're wondering. And we're dropping off the rabbit. So let's go find a good spot for him. Okay guys, so we are at On The Border and we are gonna go find a home for this little bunny. I'm just gonna be casual while these people walk behind me. Super casual. So I think we're gonna put the little bunny under here. I like hesitate to put them in rocks because I'm worried people won't, will just think they're decor. Do you guys think this is a good spot for him? I think this is a good spot for him. Or I could put him, ooh, or we could put him in the entrance way. We're just gonna have to ask because that's the rules. If you put them inside, you have to ask. So um, let me go ask, let's go ask. Hi, I have a question. Um, so I'm an artist and I'm doing this thing called the Kindness Rocks Project where you paint rocks and you like hide them. But if we hide them inside, we have to ask. Is it okay if I hide this in your lobby for people to find and take? I mean, sure. Okay, cool, thanks. <laughs> All right, we're gonna put him right here in the corner. Okay, so we are at the last location to drop off the last painted rock. We are dropping off this guy. This is my little deer. He's my favorite. I'm gonna miss him. So we're gonna drop him off and uh, inside the mall. All right, so we're heading on into the mall. All right, so where, 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 where should we put this dude? Right here, right in this corner. 
You ready? Oh my god. Yes. How cute is that? If I can get him to stay, I don't want him to fall and break his antlers. Like that? Yeah. Okay, so the last one got dropped off in the mall. As you guys saw, I waited for just a little bit and a little kid came and picked it up. He was with his family and I saw them kind of turn it over and look at the back and then they kept it. So the, first, uh, the last one has already been found. I don't know about the first two, but that's super exciting. Um, so yeah, this was a lot of fun. Um, I really encourage you to check out the Kindness Rocks project. It is really, really cool. Uh, it was so much fun to do. Um, these rocks really, were really easy to make, but like I said, they don't have to be as fancy as mine. They can be really simple, whatever you want to do, but it's just really fun to like leave these little rocks around for people to find. So yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a like. It does help me out a lot with the YouTube algorithm. Um, if you want to subscribe, that would be great. Uh, hit the subscribe button. Come join the Wonderland fam today. We make art, we eat pizza. It's a lot of fun. And don't forget to hit the notification bell as well so you can be notified every time I upload new videos. I do upload a new video every single Friday, unless I don't, <laughs> but I try to upload every Friday. So yeah, thanks for watching, and as always, have a great rest of your day. Bye guys!